A multi-million dollar settlement today, a judge in Washington, D.C. approves a settlement in a case where a trusted rabbi secretly recorded scores of women in a ritual bath. WJC's Live, Ava Durbinat tells us some of those victims were Towson University students. Ava Joy. Well, big good evening to you. There are potentially 152 victims who were recorded. We spoke with an attorney who represents some of those victims. He said this powerful rabbi violated their trust. Friday's decision was years in the making. A judge gives preliminary approval to more than $14 million for victims who were secretly recorded while they participated in a Jewish ritual by prominent rabbi Barry Frendel. The women, including his Towson University students, were recorded in various stages of undress while in the facility known as a mikvah. Two of those victims spoke with WJZ's Vic Carter in 2015. How it was presented to me was kind of like a personal baptism where you're remade new and forgiven of all your sins. Abortion is a very old issue in Jewish. Frandell, a nationally known religious scholar, also taught at Towson. Investigators arrested him in 2014 after they found hidden cameras in a radio, tissue box, and a fan. Stephen Kelly, who represents some of the victims, said their lives have been changed. When they found out that, you know, this person to whom they were going for spiritual guidance and counseling, telling their deepest, darkest secrets to, was really plotting in his mind how he was going to film them naked. You know, um, it really was devastating and horrible to them. After his conviction, the rabbi apologized to scores of victims, including students right here at Towson University. So what Freundel was doing is he was taking whole classrooms full of young women only from Towson um, to the mikvah on a field trip. Court records show there are approximately 150 victims who Frendel secretly recorded for nearly a decade. The fact that I went to the mikvah in February and I sat through the rest of class until mid-May with him and still met with him and knowing later that he had tapes of me naked in his office is mortifying. While some of these women could get up to $25,000 from the settlement, and the attorneys are trying to find other potential victims. Live tonight, Avjoy Burnett for WJZ.